Patrick, thanks. This morning, we continue our series, Coffee with the Candidates, to help you get to know the candidates running for office in the upcoming elections on a personal level. Joining us this morning is Democratic candidate for Providence Mayor Stephen Costantino. Thanks for being here this morning. Thanks for having me. You know, I think a lot of people know you because of Vendor Ravioli. I was making the joke, did you bring the cannolis? And you say you get that, and people want to have lobster ravioli. Yes, it's usually lobster ravioli, cannolis, or bread, but uh, anything is good at Vendor, so. uh. But people that may may know that you uh, like that, at first, but now you've decided to go into politics. Why is that? Because you actually went to medical school first yeah. before you had a, a life change. Yeah, actually, I did have a. Uh, uh, I went to medical school in Italy for three years and decided that um, my real passion was public service and politics, and decided to change my my career choice and really get involved in community service and 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 invest in in trying to have an influence uh, on the community. I can only imagine that medical school in Italy would be a lot like, you know, going to medical school, medical school during the day and then whipping up mama's gravy <laughs> at night. Is it something well, like that? Well, what it did, what it, it did give me a, a very world experience mm-hmm. and, 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 understood, and I was able to understand the culture a lot better, especially, especially that it was part of my own heritage. Well, you happen to be a renaissance man because I understand you enjoy ballroom dancing. You were even, before the, this whole, you know, the little campaign took <laughs> yes. off, uh, you were actually in the middle of learning how to play the piano. Yes, and uh, we'll continue that right after this campaign. Yes, I, I learned ballroom dancing, and I didn't take lessons, but I learned mm-hmm. from my mother's generation because ah. uh, being a, a family and aunts and from that generation in which ballroom dancing was so important to them, I learned it that way. You know, one of the other things that I think is interesting is that um, you have a, uh, a rap song that is in honor of you and your campaign. Tell me a little bit about that. Well, it was, uh, you know, I have these very uh, excited um, and very um, energetic uh, campaign uh, staff and supporters in the south side of Providence and they decided to surprise me one day uh, with this rap song that I found uh, it, I finally have now an appreciation of rap my music tastes are pretty eclectic I, I can go from a Bocelli to a Chris Body to a John Mayer uh, and I haven't hit the rap scene but I think now I'm, a, I'm becoming a fan of the rap scene and particularly that I have a song that's rap so very interesting yes. well thank you so much thank for joining you. us this morning and if you missed any of last night's mayoral debate all you have to do is head over to foxprovidence.com and you can watch it online time now though to get